Hi friends, welcome to Cricksurf.com and today we are going to talk about a batsman who is not well known in the Indian circuit but he has played 40 one day internationals for the team India in the uh, 1999 to 2000 uh, something and he has played four test matches he has an average of 33.34 in the one day international with a century against uh, the best team at that time which was australia so he has a he is known for that one century which he made in the pune he is a left-handed batsman he was lean he comes from the chennai he plays for vidarb in the ranji circuit so if you would have guessed it correctly by now congratulations to you if you have not we are talking about himang badani so himang badani was a very lean uh, comes up with a lean physique but uh, he was a very good stroke maker uh, the reason he didn't get that much success uh, i don't know why but if you look at his innings uh, the the innings he played against australia in pune uh, in which I think India made 248 runs, but India lost uh, 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 that match. Uh, Mark Waugh, wow, I think, uh, made uh, uh, very played very good innings in the when Australia came to bat. So Himang Badani, uh, apart from that one innings, he has not uh, that much to talk about in the uh, ODIs or the Test cricket he has played for India. But we will look. Uh, uh, about him like how his career has been and uh, from where why he was not uh, able to uh, carry on the performances he has delivered in the domestic circuit to the international circuit so uh, he has a controversy with him uh, if you remember the indian cricket league so indian cricket league uh, so many players participated in that and then they were banned by uh, the bcci but that happened after his uh, he has already played those uh, 40 matches for the India. So uh, he played in the Indian Cricket League for the Chennai Superstars team. So he was uh, then uh, adjudged ineligible for the mainstream cricket with Tamil Nadu and India because there was a, it was not affiliated to BCCI and all the players who were playing in that Indian Cricket League, they were sidelined from the uh, uh, national team selection and the domestic circuit. So. Uh, he has to quit the ICL in 2009 and he made himself available for the IPL in 2010 uh, from the Chennai Super Kings team but uh, he got selected he got the bidding in 2010 IPL but he didn't get to play any of the matches in the IPL so he has not played a uh, single match in the IPL uh, but he was sold uh, uh, as an uh, he, he along with the Tamil Nadu all-rounder Sri Ganpati were selected for the Chennai Super Kings 2010 Indian Premier League. So, if we talk about him, if we look at his uh, try to decode the innings which he played against Australia, which is available on the YouTube, I recommend everyone to watch uh, uh, that innings because that innings he paced it very superbly. Because at that time, the Australia was a very attacking team. They India used to win against them, but there were just uh, a few occasions. If we remember, there was Sharja. Uh, big just because of the Sachin's uh, 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 super meanings. Apart from that, uh, Australia was always on the top of India. They didn't. Uh, India didn't uh, have that much uh, uh, batting or bowling or so many good uh, players in their team to challenge the uh, uh, the Australian cricket team, which was just on the another level. So he played a very well constructed, well paced innings. And the shots were uh, like, uh, you know, if you look, uh, you, you will remember him as a, like a proper technique. He, the innings was just uh, uh, very good. But he didn't uh, uh, follow that innings with a great performance in the future. And that was the reason for his elimination. So he, he, he comes up with a very good record in the domestic circuit in the 1999 Reggie Trophy. He made 162 and 163 runs in the final against Mumbai team. So Mumbai, everybody knows in the Ranji circuit, he, they are the like giant in the uh, Ranji circuit. It's very difficult to get selection in the Mumbai Ranji team and to make centuries and uh, two centuries in the final against Mumbai, which is the strongest of the Ranji team. He was uh, in the pipeline for the uh, national team selection and the selection has to come at any point which came and uh, 
uh, he made his debut at the age of 23 badani came into indian one side uh, because of that uh, poach match fixing so indian team has to find some new players so they have to build a new team and himang badani was called up uh, af- apart from that he he made a, a like uh, good contributions uh, afterwards also in the energy team uh, in the finals and he had a very good tours as a vice captain in england and he so he was considered again for the chances but uh, he just didn't uh, Uh, carry on with the performance he was giving in the domestic circuit and the international circuit and that leads to uh, that's that's the reason for the short career of him so that's not much on the web on uh, himang badani apart from that he played in the icl he got banned he played uh, 1999 ranji trophy made two centuries against uh, mumbai in the finals and uh, is f- famous in ins against australia in which india made 248 runs but lost the match but uh, nevertheless a great in ins so uh, actually sort of ganguly showed uh, uh, faith in him but uh, uh, like uh, there was something missing which uh, 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 shortened his career so uh, there there is very a uh, funny incident he shared with his fans Uh, like uh, a, a ma- in a match against england uh, jawagal srinath was very nervous and uh, he was looking very wobbling which is uh, not the usual of him so sachin decided to just cool him off with sardin doing some humor thing so he told uh, himang badani which he knew that he was not playing in that match to just exchange his trousers so basically he asked himang badani to keep his trousers sachin tendulkar trousers in his uh, uh, kit and uh, jawagal srinath he, he is a 6263 guy and he didn't mind what was in the uh, bag he just uh, wore the trouser and he uh, came for the practice and when he came to the practice he was already wearing like a capri because the trouser was very short and everybody was laughing like what you have uh, wore for what you have wore, wore today and it was looking very funny and uh, then only jawagal srinath realized that uh, oh, he has uh, somebody has played with him so he asked uh, himang badani like oh, who can be the guy who has done him and himang badani was like you know sentently saying oh i don't know uh, maybe uh, somebody wants to uh, play with you but yeah, i don't know who was the guy who, who did this kind of thing this is not good so that was some humor uh, incident uh, something from his cricketing journey uh, uh which come which involves sachin tendulkar he shared with his fans so if we talk about his age his age is just 43 years of now so he is not a player like uh, he could have played like uh, if he would have uh, 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 making runs then he could have played until like uh, to the age of 38 so he could have played uh, maybe the 2015 world cup so it's it's funny in the cricket when you think about like uh, players uh, uh, so many players if you look as of now are at the age of 40 41 badrinath is there and you realize that they are they are not like out of for, out from the cricket from a very long time because if you uh, can play you can play up to 38 37 but uh, it was simply that they didn't uh, got the selection in the national team so they were out for a long time so they got selection in like 25 age 26 age and uh, 32 age and they played some matches for a year and after that uh, they didn't get to feature in the national team again so that was uh, something on himang badani and uh, uh, that's uh, 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 man of the match awards if we talk about he got the man of the match award in the one day international in uh, uh, against zimbabwe uh, i don't know why wikipedia is not showing uh, uh, that he didn't get the man of the match award in the match against australia that i will have to check because maybe the australia won and maybe the man of the match was given to Uh, the player from the winning side but that i will have to check because that was the innings of the highest quality so that was uh, uh, something a lost uh, opportunity for himang badani himself he could have done better for the team india for himself he has the caliber his technique was very good he has the shots he knew in he knew to how to pace the innings but uh, all the things uh, were just uh, uh, not uh, 
compiled together when it came to international cricket so he has been active serving the uh, uh, serving the cricket for team india in some other roles we wish him all the best for the future and uh, maybe a uh, lesson for the youngsters that uh, they should capitalize on the innings because as a batsman if you talk about you get a very uh, less opportunities so uh, means batsman it's if you're a bowler then you know that if you are going to play for india or not because uh, if you have that action you have that uh, spin you know from like age 18 or age 15 that you are going to play for india for a longer period of time but when it comes to batting there are so many batsmen there is so much competition badrinath was there badani was there uh, means there are just uh, Bada- badrinath i have uh, reiterated but uh, there were like lot of players pathan was playing but then he had a dip of form then he was out of the team and uh, suresh rana is now out of the team so it's the, these things keeps on happening with the batsmen they get chance and if they don't score in one or two matches they are out for from the team for uh, like a, uh, for uh, they didn't get to feature again so uh, that's what happens with the batsmen so that's uh, what our coverage for him and badani looks like uh, please let us know in the comments that what you, your uh, how you rate him as a hibang badani as a player and what he could have done better to uh, be a permanent place in the indian cricket if you know some interesting facts about him do let us know and i will search on if he d- really didn't get the man of the match in the match that happened against australia that's it uh, stay healthy stay safe and we will get back to you on some uh, other cricketing things until then it's goodbye